saying goodbye to an Arizona icon, former Congressman Ed Pastor, laid to rest after a week dedicated to his memory. Thanks for choosing us at 630. I'm Katie Ramos. And I'm Nick Saletti. And for Steve, retired Congressman Ed Pastor has been laid to rest at the St. Francis Cemetery after a colorful and emotional funeral. He died of a heart attack 10 days ago. ABC 15 Sonu Wasu was there for every minute of this final goodbye to an Arizona treasure. As mariachi music played in honor of retired Arizona Congressman Ed Pastor and political leaders from Senator John Kyle to U.S. House Majority Leader-elect Nancy Pelosi showed up to say their goodbyes. Flags fly at half-staff here in Arizona and over the United States Capitol today. In his memory, memory of his life and his legacy. And every time that flag waves, it's about some wonderful thing that he did and we will... Uh, we will bring that to his family. In Pelosi's eulogy, she described Pastor as a personal family friend. We loved him very much. My husband used to have um, cigars and tequila with him, so we feel personally sad about losing a cherished friend as well as a great American leader. Pelosi says just like the funeral mass, Pastor was all about culture and faith. Senator Kyle also spoke at the service, calling Pastor a great leader who was passionate, not pushy, a man with both dignity and humility, a man always loyal and dedicated to family. As a kid, I always remember every Friday, the airplane from D.C. would get in at 8, 9, 10 p.m. He would spend Friday night, Saturday, Sunday, all with us, and then go back to D.C. on Monday, and that was a weekly thing. Now his family says Ed Pastor is home for the final time. Those he leaves behind, not just here today to mourn, but to celebrate a life lived well. In Phoenix, Sonu Wasu, ABC 15, Arizona. Sonu, thank you. Me